Hi guys, my name is Christian, and today we'll be cooking chicken, cornbread, and baked beans, country style. So the first thing I'm gonna do is the chicken. It's already marinated for two days. And the only thing I have to do is just put it in the pan. Boy, you gotta heat everything in there, bro. <laughs> Hold up. Hold up. Create the oven too. Oh, it's hot. It's not. It's oh my god. Is it working? <laughs> you see, it's taking a very long time. It's supposed to already be starting now. Uh, finally, it's now working. And now, since so I'm still waiting, I can prepare the cornbread. Actually, I could probably use this. No, no, no. I could probably use this. Make sure all your your dry stuff is together, then add all your liquids. Okay, add in. Now I'm going to add in the dry mix, and then I can add in the wet mix. And then okay. I add the two cups of milk. later no, your arms in the way grab the thing grab the bowl get in front of the camera see this yeah. that's how it should look like this is that thing the whiskey i need this
I got the butter pan so it doesn't stick. Just butter all around the pan. This. Butter all around the pan. Very mushy is mostly like at room temperature. It's like a, a room temperature type of butter. Let's see. It's like they're just mushing your hands. This thing's gonna over here. How can this? Do some troubles. Now. Yes. Now the chicken is ready. I just put it in the oven. Yeah, I have to put it on. Is good enough. Now we just not to just shake it. <laughs> well, the chicken is cooking. I just have to pour the. Video's still going. Cook the next item. Now, while the chicken is cooking, I'm going to have to cook the beans. I'm going to cook the baked beans. Let's see, come on. 
It's still waiting. We'll just. They're gonna cut him off doing this. Jesus Christ. <sighs> you know, sometimes a lot of stuff takes so long. Taking so long. The beans are also taking on as well. I just put it in the front, and now the beans are just. And I put it out front. Do I need to put it higher? I should explain. What are you supposed to do with the beans? So, with the beans, you have to just. Once it gets hot, you have to mix it. Keep mixing it. And then sometimes you have to stop to just let it cook. Freaking sticky stuff on my knuckles. So guys, how's your day? Ooh, what was I look for? God. <laughs> Will you take good or right or bye? <laughs> so <laughs> How's your day? The beans are still kind of cooking. I put it at five. Mix, 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 I'm mix, going mix. to have to just take it out. Just rest it. Don't take it out. I will take it out. Just put just, it in just, the front. And you think it's like at least two more minutes. Take it, take it off. Push the heat all the way down to two, and then put it back on. So while the Chicken is still cooking. That will still be warm. Just put it to small burner and then just turn it to two. Not small burner. Just I just put it at large burner and then just put just it leave it at there. And I have freaking yeah. One more minute and then it's done. Keep running the beans just lower all the way up to two. It's still gonna have a normal temperature plus the extra two. So just let it cool down a little bit and then put it back on the stove to let it turn two. You know, this is actually a very good video. Yes, indeed. Like I said again, how's your day been? Was it fine? Was it alright? Was it chill? Was it bad would you play video games after you get back uh or just was it was it just regular come back to school and then just bro what are you talking about Okay guys, I'm back and the chicken has been finished. Now to just take out the chicken. It's done. Just yeah. Look at the chicken. Look at this. Look at the top. It's crispy. Ooh. Now the check now you have to check the inside. To make sure it is bloody or not. If it's not bloody, then it's fine. How do you know it's not, if it's not done? Blood just coming out. I don't know if it 
hat. So I'm probably gonna say, oh, but you didn't check them out. You can already tell it's fully cooked. Cause you look inside, you see this is gray. It's, like, it's fully cooked. So the chicken is done. I have to put the um, I have to put, I have to preheat the oven back to 275. No. Three hundred seventy-five degrees. A big time, but the three hundred seventy-five degrees. That's three hundred. Three hundred. I mean, nine hundred seventy-five degrees. I mean, three hundred seventy-five degrees. And three hundred seventy-five degrees. Start. You just do that with the weight. Nice. Now, while we wait, I'm gonna ask you some questions, okay? Answer them truthfully, honestly, and uh, we'll be good, okay? So, first question What inspired you to cook? By watching cooking shows, reading some cookbooks, also the different foods that I can make, and that inspired me. How did you acquire these skills? By training and learning how to cook over time. And who taught you those skills? My dad and my brother. Good and idea. sometimes my mom. Okay. What are, the, what are the different cuts you know? Cuts. What are the different type of cuts? The different type of cuts I know, I know is scoring. Slicing in half. What? What? Now later on in the future, are you going to try to become a full-blown chef? Yes. Yes, I am. And what are you doing now to prepare yourself for that future? Reading cookbooks, watching some shows. Anything else? No. See, one of my cookbooks that my dad gave me, I finished the entire cookbook. Reading some of the recipes. And what are some of the favorite recipes you found in the cookbook? You said you read the whole entire book. So what was some of the favorite recipes you, you found in that? The ribbon and the jerk, Jamaican jerk chicken, tikka masala. Alright, what is your plan for Christian Cooks? To let my channel grow, and then as I grow older, I can mature into the type of ages that I grow into. And I just keep posting videos. Also, almost every time I cook, I'm gonna make the video, I just record, and then just post it. I'm done. Good, good. Now it's. Now it's. Being set. Put. Cornbread. You're all gonna see what I'm gonna do at the end. Time cooking time. 26 minutes start. Go. Okay guys, I'm back again. Now the cornbread is done cooking. So I'm gonna just take it out. Oh, 
careful so it doesn't burn. Just fine. Christian cooks out. 